Good evening. It's Tuesday, February 15th, 2022 at 6 p.m. My name is Joe Baker and as Mayor of Kennedy, Texas, it is my honor to welcome everyone here tonight to call this special meeting of the Kennedy City Council to order. I will now call the roll and establish whether or not a quorum is present. District 1, Council Member Cindy Sines. Here. District 2, Council Member John Rodriguez. Here. District 3, Council Member Chris Parker. Here. District 4, Council Member James Douglas is absent. He is unable to attend. He's out of state at the time. District 5, Council Member Sandra Schultz. Here. Four members of the City Council are present, and we have a quorum present this evening. If everyone would please rise for the prayer and remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. Dear Heavenly Father, please be with us this evening as we gather together to do the business for the sake of the community of the people of Kennedy, Texas. Please help us to be patient with one another, to be kind with one another, and be respectful to one another, and do as you taught to do in your holy name. For it's in your name we pray. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Next on the agenda is item number five, citizen comment. Ms. Miles, do we have any signed up for comments? We only have one audience member. <laughs> JoLynn, do you have any comments for us? No, I don't. Thank you, Thank you for being here. As there are no citizen comments, we'll move on to the section of the agenda, ordinance, resolution, other action items. This section shall provide for all other official discussion and action items provided for consideration by the council. Number six, consideration and possible action in regard to business dealings with Langford and Associates. Uh, before we begin the discussion on this, I just want to uh, recommend or advise or have the council consider that we take this item into closed session under section 551.071 consultation with attorney. I anticipate the discussion will touch on some contract issues and we may have some questions for our attorney that are attorney-client privileged. So uh, if uh, anyone would entertain a motion to adjourn into uh, executive uh, session, I think that would be appropriate for this. I'll make a motion that we go into closed session. I'll second. We have a motion from council member Sines and a second from council member Parker to adjourn in the closed section under section 551.071 consultation with attorney. Uh, the time is 6.03 p.m. Do we need a vote? Okay. Yeah. Uh, Ms. Miles, if you'll call the roll. Sandra Schultz? Yes. Chris Parker? Yes. Cindy Sines? Yes. Johnny Rodriguez? Yes. All present voted in favor. Motion carries. At this time, we are going into closed session, and the time is 6.03 p.m. It is 7.55 p.m. And we are reconvening into open session following the closed session. Considering ag agenda item number six, is there any uh, discussion or action to be taken on agenda item number six, which was consideration and possible action in regard to business dealing with Langford Associates? If not, then we'll take no action on agenda item number six. Agenda item number seven, items to consider for placement on future agendas. Are there any items that anyone would like to have placed on a future agenda? Well, I would like to uh, put on for a future agenda a discussion on us, discussing uh, maybe possibly making some changes to our personnel policy on certain certain things that uh that I feel are important. Ms. Miles, will you make a note of that for future agenda? Yes, discussion changes for policy manual for grievance procedure. Yes. Any other items for placement on future agendas? For us to have a uh, 
another meeting with uh, Judy with Langford sometime in the setting a date and time for yes, a yes. special meeting uh, preferably at the end of March sometime regarding the yeah, schedule for minutes okay you have that Ms. Smells yes we're looking to set up another date and time meeting as that was set today to mm -hmm. be at the end of March yes is this going to be a separate uh, yes separate yes meeting? special meeting any other items for uh, placement on future agendas? If not, we'll move on to agenda item number eight, announcements of community interest and or upcoming events, governing body, city manager, city secretary. Any announcements from anyone? Hmm, nothing comes to mind for me, so there are no announcements of community interest. The only item that remains is to adjourn. So it is 7.57 p.m. and this meeting is adjourned. Thanks to everyone for coming this evening.